Good morning, Cougars, and welcome to Cougar Pause for Wednesday, September 17th. That's just six days until fall. Swim party at Lake Bimbrook better happen soon. That's right, Denver. There's only a few days left before the real cool down, so take advantage of these warm days while you can. Let's all stand for the Pledges of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, Indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. On the Texas flag, I pledge allegiance to me, Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. And now for a moment of silence. The book club will have its first meeting today in the library during lunch. New members are always welcome. Students who have a high volume of printing needs, for example, students in AP or IB, listen up. For $5, that's right, I said it right, $5, you will have printing privileges for the year. For all school assignments, see Mrs. Landon about more details for purchasing a print pass. Do you like to travel? Do you like the idea of becoming a precision marksman? The Air Force Junior ROTC wants to talk to you. Each year, the ROTC takes several students to different locations around the nation for competition and enrichment. Last year, marksmen from Western Hills went to national competition. And don't forget that free money for college. With the average 2013 college graduate starting life, $32,000 in debt and climbing, imagine what it would be like to go to college for free. See one of the ROTC instructors for more information about that. ASL Club is meeting today during lunch in room 309. We are rehearsing the national anthem, so quickly grab your lunch and take it to room 309. Key Club meeting in room 200 at lunch on Thursday, September 18th. Don't be late. It's been a while since we reminded you about the annual Cougars Got Talent show, so listen up. The annual Cougars Got Talent talent show will once again kick off homecoming week. Start now to plan your act. Application forms will be available September 22nd and auditions will be held at lunch in the auditorium September 30th and October 1st. If you dance, sing, juggle, do magic tricks, or have a unique talent, you could be the next Cougar Idol. The winner will ride in a convertible in the homecoming parade, receive a cash prize of $50, and a medal. Winners in each category will receive performance medals. The show will be October 6th at 7 p.m. Tickets will be on sale the week before the show for $3 and $5 at showtime. You could be the next winner. Five Western Hills High School students auditioned for the first round of the Texas All-State Choir and all will advance to the second round to be held October 11th at Burleson. Approximately 700 students auditioned at Cleburne High School on September 13th. Front row, left to right, are Irion Wright, Sapphire Brown. Second row are Cody Gothard, Andre Vanzini, Andre Vanzini, my bad, Wendell Anderson. These singers are under the direction of Mrs. Deborah Rue, WHHS Cougar Choir Director. Michael, what do the books, Captain Underpants, The Hunger Games, and The Kite Runner all have in common? I got this one. All three books have appeared on the top 10 list of challenged books. A challenge is defined as a formal written complaint filed with a library or school requesting that materials be removed because of content or appropriateness. So tell me, why are the books still allowed in schools? Let me tell you. They are allowed because the freedom, the freedom to read is guaranteed by the First Amendment of the U.S. Constitution. That's right, Michael, the freedom to freed. September 21st through 27th is Banned Books Week. The week's, this week's highlights the value of free and open access to information. Celebrate the freedom to read by stopping by the library and checking out a book of your choice. From all of us here at Cougar Paws, have a wonderful Wednesday.